So it's week one um, of full excavation and you can see the team are on site uh, on trench three behind me which is the trench over the villa um, and the first task of today really is to clean back uh, the remains of the topsoil to expose the archaeology, brighten up the colours that have baked dry over the weekend so that we can really see what's going on. We've already found pieces of pottery, some beautiful Roman uh, glass from a, a bottle or something like that. So, cracking vines already. Um, leave that stuff, that's good. Okay. It's this darker stuff, okay. potentially. I mean, it's the first morning, so we're, we're really just tidying up, but we've already found a really interesting Roman coin, which initially looks as if it might be late fourth, mid to late fourth century. Again, it's early days, you don't, you don't want to jump to conclusions, but, but I think the evidence so far is, is bearing out our suspicions that this is a quite high status Roman site. Caroline? What have you got, Rob? That's the Roman coin. Oh, nice. Ooh. That's just come out of that spoil there, has it? Brilliant. Great things to come. Well done, Rob. Thank yeah. You. Oh, I'm really enjoying it. It's perfect weather for it. It's going really, really well. And especially you can see everything that you're turning up as well, so it is easy to spot things. It's amazing. I can't wait to carry on. <laughs> I'm sure that the volunteers are really essential um, for a job like this. It's very meticulous, it's very labour intensive. And the only way that you're going to achieve anything is with volunteers giving their time and their efforts to make it happen. Finds of today. We've got this wonderful spindle whirl that's appeared. So made of um, ceramic, it would have been used in the spinning process. So we've got lots of nice domestic activities going on, which is great. And the other thing that's coming up behind me is a possible drain or flue for a hypercost that starts outside the building um, and actually runs all the way in. And as I walk along it, past these very happy diggers, um, you will hopefully see the line of it as we come through. So you've got the faced stones on the left and the right, and then a rubble core in the fill. So this is the bit where we're still working, but you can see the face on the left. Uh, in fact, Dave, could you just point out that left face for us? Um, probably about here. Perfect. And it runs all the way through the wall into the building and possibly ending around there.